Hi, fans. The post-game show is on. Here from Nagaoka, Don Callis, Kevin Kelly. The New Japan Cup is in the books for 2018. We won't spoil it for you right away if you didn't see it live. So we'll start talking about it in three, two. How about that tournament final, Don? Fantastic. Can you? No, I'm leaving it on today. You have Why? germs. You I, have germs. I don't have any. You're infecting a lot of people. We all have germs. That's right. All right. Well, how about the fact that Zack Sabre Jr. was able to go through Tetsuya Naito, Kota Ibushi, Sonata, and now tonight in the finals, Hiroshi Tanahashi to claim the New Japan Cup? It went exactly as I had predicted. I think mm. Zack Sabre Jr. is exactly the type of wrestler who can excel in a tournament because he doesn't take a lot of punishment, he doesn't take a lot of abuse, and he's able to last. And tonight, he targeted the body part and did exactly what he needed to do, get the submission over Tanahashi. Calls that finisher orienteering with napalm death. So Sounds lovely. It's wonderful. Uh, wonderful for everybody except Tanahashi. No shame in uh, Tanahashi coming so close to win his third New Japan Cup. And then, of course, uh, moments after the match, as expected, Zack Sabre Jr. challenges Okada. He will be next to face the champ at Sakura Genesis. And that's a tall order. Big size disparity there, but I will say this. Zack Sabre Jr. represents a very unique challenge for Okada in the fact that he is very unique himself. Someone different than Okada is used to facing. What I like is Zack Sabre Jr. has now got the great Taka Mishinoku as his second. And I will take Taka over Gato, the spot picker, the wood tick. The money changer, I'll take Taka every time. Well, Taka has been in Zack's corner for four big singles matches, while Gato has been there for seemingly hundreds of matches for Okada. Ten successful title defenses. If he wins one more, he ties Tanahashi's record of 11, and so that will happen at Sakura Genesis. Two weeks' time, April the 1st. Don, you'll be there, correct? I, I know will? I'll be there. Yes. Is that a big show? It is. Okay, I'm in for the big shows. That's all I know. Gotcha. Well, it was, of course, Okada. Uh, also tonight in tag team action, uh, teaming with Chucky e. T against uh, Chase Owens, Kota Ibushi. Uh, there were some moments in there where it could have swung either way, but in the end, Okada, with that submission hold of his own. It could have what? Could have swung either way. Could have kind of swing either way. Swung. I gotcha. You know, Chase had said beforehand he was going to beat uh, Okada with the package file driver. Didn't happen. <sighs> maybe don't telegraph it next yeah, maybe. time. Maybe don't talk about it, Chase. I mean, Chase is a guy with million dollar wrestling skills and a five cent brain sometimes. I really worry about Chase. How about He's Minoru? He's a manager. Minoru Suzuki uh, going after Tetsuya Naito early and often tonight. Uh, those two are on a collision course. How about Rapongi 3K coming out and getting involved once again when they're not even booked on the show uh, to go after uh, Hiromu Mbushi and Despi and Kanemaru. They look great tonight. They look better than they've ever looked. And you notice that Rocky Romero, the, the hit machine with an S in front of it, wasn't here tonight. Maybe uh, draw a little conclusion there. Rocky's so lazy now. He's not only taking a payoff from these kids, he doesn't even come to the shows. He sits home in California, collects you know, a check. You know, you could almost change Rocky's name with Don, because you don't show up, you come in for the big shows, and you collect a check. You ever heard in a wrestling business they call it an attraction? I'm an attraction. You don't want to give the people too much of a good thing. They can't handle it. You're the meat and potatoes guy. You're here. They can put you out there. And you're, you're good to finish in fifth or sixth place in the Meltzer Awards every I'm year. Happy to do so. Uh, so, of course, also, uh, there was a heavy challenge laid down by KES. They were victorious in a tag team match over Chaos. They're going to face Evil and Sonata sometime soon. I can't confirm yet whether it'll be Sakura Genesis, but you have to believe that would be logical. Hey, listen, don't inject, inject logic into professional wrestling, Kevin Kelly. Right, only you would do that. Only I would do that. We had a lot of fun here in Nagaoka. And of course, now we head to California for Long Beach and Strong Style Evolve. 
Uh, that'll happen this Sunday or Monday morning, depending on where you are. That guy back there is giving me the finger, or no, is that no, the no. is that one minute? He's telling you. To oh, wrap. it's one minute. We're gonna wrap it up. Yeah, don't get cocky. So we'll see everybody in Long Beach. We're gonna have a lot of exclusive content from uh, from Strong Style of and from the fans. Am I calling well. it this year? Because no. people are asking me if I'm calling it. No, we're not. All right, then I'm gonna get paid and go to the bar. There you go. Perfect. All right, so that wraps it up for Nagoka. For Don Callis, I'm Kevin Kelly. Congratulations, Zach Saber Jr. You're a 2018 New Japan Cup winner.